I don't know if you can hear me. Good morning, everyone. Thank you for being here. Mr. President, it is such an honor and it is so comforting to the men and women in uniform, to the mothers, fathers, brothers, sisters who have suffered because of gun violence in our country, to the Attorney General Garland, Governor Hocko, and Mayor Adams, thank you for making it possible, but also in recognizing that it takes all of us working together. To my New York con congressional delegation, I want to recognize the incredible role that we have played in working together with this administration to make sure that we secure the resources, not only to deal with gun violence in our country, but to tackle the issue of the pandemic, uh, to provide relief assistance to small businesses in our country. And I am proud that we have been able to get this economy growing again, that because of the commitment and vision of President Biden. Since the start of the pandemic, gun violence in our city has surged to levels not seen in a decade. Shootings are up by 166% here in New York City. Across the U.S., over 20,000 people were killed by gun violence last year. Black and brown communities. We are victims of gun violence. It takes us also because we are on the ground. We know what works and what doesn't work. We got the expertise and we need to use all those grass, grassroots community organizations who understand the dynamics that play into gun violence in our country. So these statistics are not just numbers. Each represents a lost member of our communities. We must recognize that mobilizing community-based resources, job opportunities, and early intervention are key to protecting our youth from gun violence. We must also, once and for all, crack down on the iron pipeline of illegal guns being funneled into states like New York. This is just not a public safety issue, but one that requires partnerships with healthcare institutions, school, job-creating programs, churches, as Hakeem Jeffrey just said. We are all hands on deck. This is how we're going to tackle this issue. And I want to recognize uh, Losures Anti-Violence Program in North Brooklyn, working with NYCHA, New York City Housing Public uh, Authority, and they are working to stem the gun violence issue in public housing. They have been successful. It is proven. It can work. Let's do it. Thank you.